Kinder is coming with a brand new set of Funko Pop eggs and they're all Jurassic World themed. These were only available in Europe. They have not come to North America yet. So I was lucky enough to have a little bit of help from my friend Kevin over at Mini Mysteries. He sent me a letter that says congratulations on 3 million followers. Also, he was wondering what was up with the black light colors. And if I'm gonna be honest, I don't really know. And with every single one of the dinosaurs, they are this black light, like this T-Rex here. And we'll have to find out why when we open them up. Also, apparently there's a holographic T-Rex inside, so fingers crossed we can get one. And because this video wouldn't be possible without Mini Mysteries, I linked his channel in the description down below. Let's try to get him to 30,000 subscribers. But now everybody, it is time to crack these open. There are 36 to go through, and I am excited about it because I really wanna see if we can get everything in the set. The only thing is, I don't know exactly how many are here. I believe it's maybe like eight to 10 different figures? I think so. Oh, and right away, you might notice that these are actually the Kinder Joys, not the Kinder Eggs. You know, the ones with the chocolate around them. And if you guys want to see how it looks on the inside, instead of, of course, having that chocolate egg, they give you this, which is pretty cool. There's also a little spoon that comes inside where you can actually scoop out the chocolate. And I gotta say, I think I like this a little bit more than the regular eggs. And well, anyways, enough eating the candy. Let's actually get into this first one here. And I guess with any of these, the first one is always brand new and let's see Ooh. okay this is neat for the first one here we got the giganotosaurus and i like the colors on it it's got the blue or kind of like teal colored teeth with the purple body and the yellow eyes a pretty great start and now i want to see if on the sheet here does it give me a checklist because i would love to have one okay they do Kinda. There's a few of them on here. And well, anyways, if you want to take a look at it, you can get a good idea as to what comes inside. I have a feeling it could be kind of hard to finish off the set, though. And anyways, getting into egg number two here, let's crack this open and see. As long as we don't get this Giganotosaurus, I will be happy. Ooh! Now, to be completely honest with you here, I don't exactly know what dinosaur this is. Maybe, like, a raptor? I also don't think it'll say, but I can at least find out what you're supposed to do with it, because it seems like you put this on the like a pencil maybe if i were to guess oh it's a phone stand oh how interesting i guess you would like click the phone into the side there yeah that totally makes sense and if you know what dinosaur this is put it in the comments Alrighty, egg number three let's find out who's gonna be inside of here and again i'm hoping for no doubles on this one we've got hey somebody different oh and you know what this is another one of those dinosaurs i might have trouble with here for some reason it reminds me of it i don't think it's a dilophosaurus is it it's that one with like that big metal plate or not metal but it's like a bone plate on the front and then it's got the horns on the side and this one here actually seems like a pencil holder but of course i've got to check to see what we've got going on yes it is a pencil holder but again just looking at this one here i know it's not a dilophosaurus now that i think about it because the dilophosaurus has that big thing that comes out of the side Ooh, somebody help me out here well anyway so far we are three for three on different dinos and that's pretty much all we can hope for now i'm wondering if that that rare one, I think it glows in the dark from what I can remember, or maybe it's kind of shiny. Oh, -ho! but here we go. This is a good one. I'm actually really enjoying this with the blue body, and then it's almost like they put the bones or kind of like what the skeleton would look like on the sides. Wow, pretty nice detail. And still everybody, four for four. Alrighty, here we go. Let's find out on this fifth one here if it's going to be different. I'm gonna guess it is. And the one that I would really like is the pterodactyl. I think it'd be so cool to have that. Hey, we got another one. Wait a second, is this the rare one? Or maybe I'm thinking of something else. I'll have to look again but it feels different from the rest of them. This one's a little bit rubbery. I like it, but I don't think it's that rare one because now looking at the front again, this one almost seems to like glow. So I think it's a little bit different. And let's see if maybe it is inside of this one. Oh, our first double of the day. We've got another cord holder. We got two in a row. And anyways, everybody, let's get into this next one here. We are almost done the top and then we'll get into the bottom eggs. And let's see what we've got going on here. Please, there'll be another double. Let's find out though. Hey, it's new! And now you know what? From a first look, I don't know what dinosaur this is. I want to say it's a raptor, but like it's hard to tell when they've shrunk it down and made it a random color. Somebody help me out. I have a feeling this is going to be a reoccurring theme for today. I don't know many of these dinosaurs. 
because of just how random they look. But of course I know some of them. Oh, and I would love an Ankylosaurus. I just saw that on the side there. That would be pretty sweet. And anyways, here we go, everybody. Let's find out who we've got here. Whoa, this is cool. Is this a Brachiosaurus or a Bronchiosaurus? The big tall ones. You guys know what I'm talking about? That is sick. And it actually came in three parts, probably so it could fit inside of the egg. Oh, wow. Yeah, that is amazing. I never even saw that on the box anywhere. No, I don't think it is. So what a fun little one that you really had no clue unless you opened it up. And it also looks like this one here is a phone stick. Stand. It's got the flat tail on the bottom to like hook it in probably. And now let's get into, I don't even know here, our seventh or eighth egg. There's so many that I've gone through. It's a lot. And here we go. Oh, we got the rare one. Oh, I can tell. I can totally tell that this is the rare T-Rex. Oh my gosh. We got one. Ah, how crazy is that? Okay, I'm holding it up to the light here, and it seems like on the inside, it's actually like a full skeleton. Oh, 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 wow, that is neat. I'm gonna have to put that somewhere special. Let's move it off to the side here. And still crazy that we only have one double out of all of the ones I've opened. I thought there was only eight in the set, but clearly there is a lot more than that. And so let's just keep going here. We'll crack open these three here, and then we'll go on to the next row, and we'll just keep going till I have none left. And this year, ooh, this is new. This this is new. Is this another T-Rex? Maybe it kind of looks like it. It's got the short arms. It's got kind of a pink body instead of that one there. But seriously, that is still crazy that I got it. Because apparently they are super rare. People are opening up entire cases and not getting that one. But today we got it in like 10. And yes, this is definitely a T-Rex. Ooh, I'm liking this one too. They're actually kind of different molds as well, so it's fun. Alrighty, our second last one on the top row. And I'm hoping for another new one. Maybe that Ankylosaurus would be cool. And, ooh, okay. Is this, oh, you know what? I don't know the name of this dinosaur. It's like, uh, it's the one with the feathers on the top. Oh, somebody help me out here. Is this a Therizinosaurus? Am I crazy or am I totally thinking of like a different one? Or maybe I've got it spot on, I don't know. But either way, it is orange and green and purple. I like it. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten unique dinosaurs. I mean, come on. Let's hope we get another one in here too. And that's crazy because I'm looking on the side here and I don't think I have, I have one of them on the side here and there's still another oh my gosh uh seven over wow okay we've got another one of that charger holder i don't know maybe that's the easiest one to get it seems like it so far can't complain too much though because we already have the rare one and now let's take the top row off and get to the bottom stuff because i don't know if you guys could see it but that is a lot of eggs Alrighty, here we go we'll start in the front here and then we'll move across <laughs> okay this is exciting and let's see, I'll show you guys in a second. Did I get a double? Yeah, I did. It's my second dinosaur to get a double because the other ones were all the exact same character. So yeah, we've got that purple, orange, and green one again. Again, let me know who is this or what kind of dinosaur is it? And anyways, everybody, we still have, what is this, another 23 to go through. I think we had only opened up 12 on the top. Okay, here we go though. Come on, oh my gosh, I got another rare one. How insane is this? It's the one with the skeleton on the inside. Oh, ho, ho, ho. that is crazy. Anyways, everybody, let's get into this one. And I'm hoping that we can finish off this set. Again, I don't really know when I'm going to be finishing this off because I don't know how many there are. But I think by the end of this, we'll just see how many I've got. And if there's any different ones on the side of the box, I'll know if I'm finished or not. Because besides that, we have no indication. And here we are. Hey, we got a pterodactyl. Wow, we okay. Let me see how I could put these in here. I think you just like slide them in the sides. Oh, you do. This thing is massive for a Kinder egg. Oh, yeah. Check that thing out. I don't know how to make it. I don't. Hold on. Let me try again. I can't. It's the same noise again. I can't. I can't do it. I I'm trying. Whatever. It's not a big deal. Let's just continue here. And I'm hoping... Mm, I still want that Ankylosaurus, if that is the name of the dinosaur. I think I've got it right. And... You're kidding! Oh my gosh, I got a third T-Rex! And not just any old T-Rex, that clear one, whoa, with the skeleton inside. One of the craziest pulls, again, we have three of it. Seriously, 
How do you beat that? Look at them! And now I'm curious, at this point, how many do we think I'm gonna be getting out of this entire video? Pop your numbers in the comment section below because we still have another... What is this, like, uh, oh, 18, 19, 20 to go? Something like that, maybe even more. Now that I'm looking down, who is this? It's somebody new. Oh, no, it's not. No, 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 we got this one earlier. It's that one that I don't remember the name of. It's that, like, curled up one. It's got the big, like, uh, like plate on the front. You know what I'm talking about. Ooh, come on. Let's find out. It is new. And from the looks of it, it's a Triceratops. Oh yeah, this is nice. And is this one on the side of the box? It's not. How many are in this set? I still need one, two, three, four, five. Let, let me just show you what I've been looking at here. All of these guys here, I still need five of them from the side of the box. Beats me. And if you guys have any clue on how I can figure out where the entire set like list is, I would love to see it. Well, anyways, everybody, we still have three more rows to go through. And I think we're gonna crack these on but a little bit faster maybe until we get a new one because I have a feeling we're gonna start to get a lot of doubles. But then again, maybe not. Oh, we're slowing down again. We've got another new one. Oh, 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 there's a third piece. I was gonna say this thing, I don't think that's a dinosaur. Never mind. hold on, I gotta put it in there. Give me a second. Took me a second to figure it out, but I got it. It's that one with like the big bill on the front. It actually looks really great with all the pieces together. And is also another one that is new and not on the side of the box here. So seriously, this thing just keeps going and going. I really do like the variety in here. Alrighty, come on, let's see what we've got. This one's gonna be a double. I have a hunch on this one. It is... Not. It's another new one. And actually, funny enough, it is the Ankylosaurus that I've been talking about almost this entire video. Definitely a cool figure to get, and I like the blue and green together, especially with those pink colored eyes. Lots of fun, and anyways, let's continue here with this next one, which is going to be... Oh! T-Rex! It feels not that rare anymore, or maybe I'm just getting super lucky. Because this really is crazy, the amount that I'm getting. Four! Four in one case! I remember too, when the Harry Potter set of Kinder Eggs came out, they were selling the golden Harry Potter for a crazy amount online. So I wonder if people are gonna try to sell this one for a lot too? I would think so. But hey, I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna be getting rid of this one anytime soon. Maybe we'll do a giveaway in the future if you guys would like to see it. But for now, I'm keeping them around. And here we are, let's find out. Oh, we got another one of those cord holders. You know, the one that goes on the side of the, like the table. I don't need another one of this guy. I mean, he's all right, but I would like a new character first. And now let's keep going here. Okay, we have another, let me figure this out here. Is it six per row, so like 14 to go? And let's find out what is inside of here. And it would have been so cool if they did like those new fossil pops that they had. I know there is this one here with the T-Rex, but you know where you could like actually see the bones all the way around. Anyways, let's just open this thing up here and find out. This is new, I think, maybe. Maybe. Oh, you know what, actually, now that I'm looking at it here, this might be the first one that we opened up, the Giganotosaurus. Yeah, I think it is. Yes, it looks like it. But anyways, let's continue here with this one. And I'm just gonna crack it open really quickly. I kinda wanna have another one of the Kinder Joys now, but I'm gonna save it till after. Maybe if we get a fifth one of these guys, we'll celebrate with some of the chocolate. But anyways, here we go. Oh, I didn't mean a fifth one of this guy. We got another cord holder. Oh, come on. Whatever, it's fine. I'll live with it. But I mean, to have a different one, it would be nice. We have two full rows to go, which like I said, is another 12 characters. And I'm still hoping for, do we have the full side here? No, we need the Dilophosaurus, as well as that winged one with like the feathers on it. And then also it looks like a T-Rex that goes around a pencil. So let's find out. Hmm. I do not need another, and we still need more for the sets. Okay, here we go. Come on, come on. Let's find out here. What do we got? What do we got? Ooh, no, it's not new. This is not new. It's funny, though. Every time I look at it, it always seems new inside of the box. It's that one that's curled up. It goes around your pencil. I still don't know the name of it because I haven't had time to look it up in between me opening eggs. And anyways, let's see here. Who is it? Okay, I'm gonna check it. Let me peek really quickly. Oh, another double. It's literally two in a row for this one. I do not need another, but here's the thing. I know a couple people that are big fans of Jurassic World and Jurassic Park. I'm sure they would enjoy some of these. So it's not the biggest deal, but I mean also I would like to finish off this collection like we've been trying to do this entire episode. And so let's find out who's going to be inside of here. Is this new? No. But you know what? This is the Triceratops, which isn't too bad. I only have. Now this is my second. So hey, it's a pretty cool one to get two of, especially because I mean, 
Unless you want the dead version of this one, you're not getting a regular size pop of it. Oh, but I guess you know what? They also have the skeleton. Well, no, I'm not. Hold on, let me take that back. They're both. Yeah, never mind. Come on, come on, something new. Not new. You know what, now that I think about it, I just thought of another name for a dinosaur. Do we have any Atrociraptors in here? I'd have to remember what they look like. This might be one, or I might be completely wrong. But no, you know what, now that I think about it, this could be an Atrociraptor. Earlier, when I opened this one up though, you may have noticed I didn't say the name of it because I couldn't think of it. But yeah, it might be, it might be an Atrociraptor. Alrighty, everybody, seven to go. We've got this one, then the back row. Oh, and let's find out. Feels kind of large. I wouldn't be mad at another pterodactyl, maybe. It is... Oh, wow! It is another pterodactyl! Okay, what a weird coincidence. There we go. Not too bad. I guess I'll just... Uh, I don't have enough room for more pterodactyls. They're so wide. We'll just push them in there. That should be fine. And now, getting on to the back row. Okay, here we go. Feels kind of wide. I'm gonna say... Oh, I would love another T-Rex. Is it... Oh! No, but this is a new one. This might actually be a T-Rex. It's the one that kind of like wraps around a pencil. Maybe it's a T-Rex. It's kind of hard to tell at the angle it's at. Could also be a Velociraptor. I don't know. Let me know what you guys think. I'm looking to see if there's any other ones that I still need. On the side of the box here, there is still that one. It's kind of like the, the feathery one that wraps around a cord. That would be cool to get. Oh, well, speaking of feathery and flying, we've got another pterodactyl. Pressing the wings in, pressing the wings in. Okay, alrighty, alrighty. We're getting down to it here. We have another four, not many. Okay, here we go. Let's see. Is it gonna be that other one that I need still? It is. Do I have this? I don't. I don't think I do. It's a new Dilophosaurus. Fun. Yeah, I like this a lot. It's also really funny to see them split because sometimes they put like fun things inside of them. Like I noticed earlier, you could see the teeth, but when you click them together, you didn't really see them. So like they totally didn't have to add that. But yeah, the Dilophosaurus in orange here, that is neat. Kind of reminds me of the red one they did a few years back, which was also pretty cool. I like that one a lot. But anyways, getting on to this next one here. Hmm, I'm trying to think of what I want. I guess, well, a new one would be great. But uh, yeah, maybe a rare T-Rex also I wouldn't complain about. This is, oh, again, that wrapping one, which I don't know. Was it a T-Rex? Is it a raptor? Someone let me out. Okay, um, hmm. I guess we'll just open it and find out. Ah, the same one again. Then again, though, I can't complain because of the amount of rare ones that I got. I honestly didn't even expect to get one, so to have four of that really is crazy. Okay, anyways, put them down here. Okay, this is the last egg of... Woo -hoo -hoo, gotta be careful here. Last egg of the day, everybody. Let's see. Are we gonna be getting something new, something rare, something different? That would be great. Okay, here we go. I'm gonna open it slowly. Let me see. This is again, everybody, that weird one I don't remember. You put the pencil in the middle of it, and anyways, there it is. All of the eggs that we opened up for today. And well, everybody, there we go. 36 eggs open with some pretty crazy stuff inside, especially with these rare ones. Let me just show you two of them together, because I mean, come on, how often do you see this? Especially with there being two more right here. But anyways, with that being said, that's pretty much gonna do it for today. Thank you again to Mini Mysteries for helping me out with these, because it really is cool to have this many eggs all at once. But again, that's gonna do it, and I'll see you tomorrow!